Nature nerds, listen up. Spring and fall are, of course, big moments for changes out in nature. And you are about to meet three very cool scientists whose work is all about studying those kinds of changes. We asked them to tell us about a favorite season-related nature find. I was an undergraduate during COVID and I took a pilot course about phenology. That was my intro to being interested in the timing of when plants flower. And then I got this tattoo of Calicordus albus. And this is actually the same genus as my favorite phenology Ina annotation. Which is? This one of the San Luis Mariposa lily. This flower is really cool. It only grows on the central coast of California. It blooms in late spring and early summer. I always get really excited to see these flowering on the trail, especially as someone who's interested in phenology. The study of nature's timing, phenology, helps us to understand how relationships in nature are playing out and how they might be impacted moving forward. This red maple is in my neighborhood and every year for the last 10 years I've like gone by and checked it out. Waiting for those first leaves to appear is something that I just love being able to like catch and to like document. You can see this photo has the seeds of the red maple, but what's so cool to me is this also has a very early leaf bud. Phenological events are happening all the time, all around the world, so how the heck are we supposed to keep track of all of that? This is where community science comes in. And my favorite eye naturalist observation is the slick's hat. It's a species that I observed in Germany. I traveled there to study urban biodiversity, and eye naturalists provide a huge amount of data across the world for us to study biodiversity diversity and phenology, such as the timing of flower in urban areas as well as natural areas. Anyone, anywhere can take a photo, share it to a naturalist, and then you can go in and add annotations online. Maybe share whether you're seeing a caterpillar or a butterfly, or a bud or a flower. So thanks for hanging out, happy nature searching, and I hope you see some flowers bloom.